So guys, first of all, I want to start out YouTube-wise because we have so many dreams for our YouTube channel. But like, uh, dreams for my life will be probably said later on. So first of all, we're going to try to do this as fast as we can. Let everything just soak in and just like try to wing this because like if I lose count, then I end up trying to figure out where I left off. So first we're going to start off with YouTube, like my dreams of YouTube. So guys, very first thing I want to talk about is my dream of being a big beauty guru. I actually am a small beauty guru, like like you probably already know, but like I want to be even bigger. So like I'm I'm all about my makeup. So like I would love to have a lot of makeup. And to start off with makeup wise, guys, I would love to do sponsorships. But, like, if they could pay me under the table, I can do it. But, like, if not, and I get checks, I'll probably end up losing my monthly check, which I get off my dad, where he's disabled and I'm disabled. Because I have a little, bit, a little bit of Down syndrome. But, like, since he's disabled and my mom and dad both divorced when I was 12, I still, however, get that check. So, like, we cannot do that unless we do it under the table. So, yeah, I would love to do sponsorships. And only if we can do it under the table, like I said. But, back to what we was talking about. So, like... My next dream would have to be to um, have a bigger camera and have my own YouTube studio and also to be able to go on trips, on pay trips by YouTube it itself and just like getting to visit other countries but like not way out of the US because like that's just dangerous. It is just dangerous. But like only if my girl Alicia Marie and uh, her sister Ash, uh, Ashley and Mia Stammer and Remy Ashton, yeah, if they were going, I'd, I'd want to go because you know I fall into the same ca category as they all are because they're all beauty gurus and they all have this same dream that I have, and that's just like. Yeah, and also, I would love to give to my subscribers, so maybe I can start doing, like, small giveaways, so, like, a giveaway, like, uh, like uh, gift cards and stuff like that, so, like, yeah, but I cannot actually buy, like, big computers and stuff like that and cameras and just, like, give it away if I know that I can use it, then, like, maybe others can use it, but, yo, I don't have that kind of money, so, like, I would love to have the money that they, that they all actually have to, uh, in order to make a living off of their channel and off of um and from their lives as well so on to uh, my life's dreams uh i used to model for so i'm, I'm just going to do this very quick and that way this video won't be too long so yeah but first of all i would love to be a model because i modeled when i was in uh I modeled for a store called Fashion Bug when it was out in the, like when the millennium start like in 2000 and 2001. But in 2002, I started uh, I started my high school year, and I was 15 years old. So I I got to have a lot of fun in my like in my childhood days, and I still want to live out th those dreams of my childhood, especially going back to Walt Disney World because I love Walt Disney World. It's my favorite place in the world and I that was my whole childhood there was uh, when I got to go to Walt Disney World anytime that I wanted. That was because like my, that, that was actually when my mom and dad were married and my dad worked for a living and actually had the money to take us on these big trips to Florida and to Tennessee and actually we've been to North Carolina about like a couple or a few times where we went to Cherokee, North Carolina just to see the Indians and of course Gatlinsburg. Guys, I love Gatlinsburg. We love it. Uh, one year we went, there was they actually had real reindeer on the side of the street and I'm like, Mommy, can we go? Because I want to see the reindeers. So we went and saw the reindeers and it was like a lot of fun and like I just wish that my childhood dreams came back to me and came true because that would mean the world to me. And also, um, I've been on TV before, just like my, my like the note, like local news. I have been on there when we was in high school, 
well. When I was in high school, there was this program called the Res Program to what to raise awareness against tobacco use for like you know tobacco itself, and um, like we like like that we had like a couple of times when I was interviewed up here in our community when we had a festival called the Dogwood Festival. And then uh, one time when I was little, uh, my mom, my dad, and me uh, went to Beckley to the Raleigh County Armory. And to be H, I had a lot of fun, but like we got to meet the Harlem Globetrotters. That's when they were like so famous like the original Harlem Globetrotters. And I was always kind of girl, like kind of tomboyish, but like I was girly at the same time. So don't get me wrong. I still like, I still love the Harlem Globetrotters and I still have my souvenir of them where they actually saw this ball. And the reason why I got the ball is that uh, they, one of them actually got me out on the, uh, on the ball court. And uh, they were just like having a lot of fun. And where, like, before I got to leave, he was like, Yo, wait a minute. Like, we got something for you. If you can make this sh this shot from here, then you get a, a signed souvenir. So I tried my best. And he was like, You know what? Since you did all the hard work and you, you tried your best, you get to keep the ball. So I still have the ball. It's like up here in my up building, like in my like upstairs building up there, like outside. So, I still have it and I still can just like remember, uh, <laughs> what am I saying? Remember the memories of it. So like I cherished every moment that I ever had when I was little. And now that I'm bigger, like I want to live that so bad, like so much, like again and again and again. That it's just like, you know, I'm living my dream. That's the whole point of having dreams is that like you can actually make them come true. And of course, acting, I, I've acted before. Um, I am a big lock acting. <laughs> yeah. And I've got to where um, I used to do these plays for a school and for a church that we went up here to visit. And um, let's just say we had a lot of fun and uh, it was like a Christmas play. So it was all about the death of Jesus and Oh my goodness, guys, that was the most amazing play we've ever had. And to be H, uh, let's say what else? Uh, this video has already gone up to eight minutes, and I don't want to go like too, too long. But like, we're having so, so much fun. Um, actually, let's say what else do we have? I've actually been in the newspaper before, so I'm into advertising. Um, but like, if I can be like one thing in the world I don't know I'm just rambling but like I've actually been in the newspaper before for giving my hair to locks of love foundation uh, for a for a needy kid uh, that didn't have hair and actually my hair is natural it's not actually colored nor anything and you can tell cuz like I got some grays and, like if you can't see it then you're blind um, I mean yeah come on you can actually see grays in dark hair like really bad so, yeah, we got some gray hairs going. <laughs> but, uh, like, um, my biggest, another biggest dream that I want to have that I've missed out on and I miss so much is that I got to be myself. I didn't have to hide anything because, like, back then, like, you didn't have no worries. Like, everything was so simple and just, like, simple living as a child. And so I really miss having a PlayStation 1 because I actually had a PlayStation 1 I had. All the games that I had was like my favorite ones were Spyro, Crash, um, Frogger. I actually have Frogger right now and it's from a PlayStation 2. But like I'd love to have a PlayStation 1 again. So like, yo. Mm. But we had so much fun living our childhood. And like I'm just like yo, if we had if we can recreate these, we would. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy this video. We're actually up to 10 minutes, and that is like my limit to any kind of video. But let's go ahead and end this video. But we hope that you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoy your day. Hope you had a happy Valentine's Day. I'm gonna get off here and let you guys go. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Please be sure if you're not already subscribe to my channel. 
Also, don't forget to click on the bell to be notified every time that I upload a new video. And of course, don't forget to like and comment on this video. And with that being said, let's go. Bye.